wa sallallahu ala nabiyil karim wa ba'd assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh alhamdulillah we are back again to continue with our program jam past questions on islamic studies this is the lesson 4 of the program we shall inshallah today deal with 10 questions and their answers question number 1 says one of the major consequences of riba is that it makes people a wealth b lazy c smart d parasitic the answer is b lazy riba is forbidden because of the harmful effects that result from it such as the economic effects <clears throat> question number two says what differentiates hadith codice from hadith nabawi is the a place and manner of application b condition under which the two are narrated c wording and teaching intended d chain and reliability of the narrator the answer is c wording and teaching intended hadith codice is the speech of allah and narrated by the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam while hadith on nabawiyah is the speech of the prophet and narrated by the sahaba question number three in surah al-ma'un quran chapter 107 we learn that a good believer should not a assist in wrongdoing b tell lies c repulse the orphan d harm a fellow muslim the answer is c that a good believer should not repulse the orphan that is Question number four. One of the peculiarities of Sahih al Bukhari is that hadith are sorted according to A. Topic, B. Chapters, C. Records, D. Biographies. The answer is B. Chapters. Question number five. One of the two compilers of hadith that deals with legal traditions of permissions and prohibitions is a abu dawood b bukhari c ibn majah d muslim the answer is c ibn majah question number six imam malik ibn anas was born in a basra b al madina c makkah d kufa the answer is B, Al Madina. Question number seven. The minimum number of witnesses in an Islamic marriage is A, four males, B, three males, C, two males, D, one male. The answer is C, two males. Question number eight. In Surah Al Falak, the Quran refers to an element of witchcraft and the A, evils of jinns and men, B, mischief of the envious one, C, mischief of created beings, D, evils of backbiting. The answer is B, mischief of the envious ones. That is, Wamin Shari Hasidin Ida Hasad. Question number nine. The term Sharia refers to A, a path, B, wisdom, C, passion, D, an idea. The answer is A, a path. Question number 10. One of the scholars reported to have been imprisoned by his non-compromising stance was A, Shafi'i, B, Abu Hanifa, C, Hanbali, D, Malik, Bin Anas. The answer is Abu Hanifa. Alhamdulillah, we have come to the end of this contact. I wish you will be with me in the next contact. I remain Muhammad Kabir Abdul Aziz. Subhanaka Allahumma wa bihamdik. Ashadu an la ilaha illa anta. Astaghfirka wa atubu ilaik. Assalamu alaikum.